You're listening to WVCU Radio in Athens, West Virginia, transmitting programming that's out of this world. Here at WVCU, you You never never know what you'll get. Our DJs are jacks of all trades, covering pop to country, sports commentary, to metal. So tune in to WVCU The Cure and see what wild card you're dealt. But no matter what you get, you know it's the best. You can also be a part of the action by calling in and requesting a song or participating in giveaways. Take advantage of something great. Just listen in on Channel 16. We're at wvcu.concord.edu. WVCU Radio. The Cure. Stress of the daily grind can leave us feeling unfulfilled, unhappy, and leave almost no time to maintain a regular exercise routine. Luckily, Concord University offers a free on-campus fitness center with state-of-the-art equipment open seven days a week. Keeping an exercise routine has never been easier and can help students control weight, combat health conditions and diseases, reduce stress, boost energy, and promote better sleep. So help improve your general well-being by taking advantage of the Concord University Fitness Center located next to the North Towers Lobby. This has been a PSA from WVCU. WVCU listener, come on down! Did you know you could win prizes just by listening to WVCU radio? Every day there is a chance to win. Just tune into your favorite WVCU shows and listen for chances to win giveaways such as Subway Meals, Flex Dollars, and more. Every show does it differently, so be prepared for anything. For more information, visit facebook.com slash concordradio and keep listening in on channel 16 and at wvcu.concord.edu. You are listening to WVCU Radio in Athens, West Virginia, bringing you the best radio content on the East Coast. Stay tuned to Channel 16 or wvcu.concord.edu. Programming and content provided by WVCU Radio is sponsored in part by West Hinkle State Farm. While State Farm is best known for its auto and home insurance, West Hinkle State Farm also offers life insurance, health insurance, and even mortgages and auto loans. State Farm's mission is to help people manage the risks of everyday life, recover from the unexpected, and realize their dreams. West Hinkle State Farm is located on 492 Courthouse Road in Princeton. Drinking makes for a fun time with your friends, but there are several problems that can arise from overconsumption of alcohol. Besides the obvious effects on the brain, alcohol can cause high blood pressure, irregular heartbeat, fibrosis, throat and liver cancer, and a weakened immune system. The National Institute on Alcohol Abuse and Alcoholism advises that men drink no more than four drinks in a single day and no more than 14 a week, with women three a day and seven a week respectively. Alcohol abuse is something that can ruin your health as well as your life, so WVCU would like to remind you to have fun and drink responsibly. It's a proven fact that WVCU Radio will make you cooler. Gangsters, what's up guys? So stay tuned to Channel 16 or at wvcu.concord.edu and be the talk of the campus. Programming for WVCU Radio is sponsored in part by Cheap Thrills Records. With locations in Princeton and Beckley, Cheap Thrills has music items like CDs, vinyls, t-shirts, and posters, as well as other home entertainment such as movies and video games. Cheap Thrills Records has trade-ins as well as a cash for gold service. Cheap Thrills is open 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. Monday through Saturday and 1 to 6 on Sunday. You can find Cheap Thrills online at CheapThrillsRecords.com. Your life could change in the blink of an eye. According to Distraction.gov, 11% of all drivers under the age of 20 involved in fatal car accidents were reported as distracted at the time of the crash. At any given moment across America, approximately 660,000 drivers are using cell phones or manipulating electronic devices while driving. Types of distractions that can cause auto accidents include texting, using a cell phone, eating, talking to passengers, grooming, reading maps, and adjusting the radio. We are all in a hurry from time to time and attempt to multitask while driving, but it can be deadly. WVCU would like to remind you that it's better to be late than dead. Drive safe and avoid distractions. This has been a public service announcement from WVCU Radio. It's time for some football. Did you know WVCU Radio has live commentary of Concord University football games? That's right. You can hear color commentary of the Mountain Lions even if you have to miss the game. All you need to do is tune into Campus Channel 16 or log on to wvcu.concord.edu to show your support for the old maroon and gray. Let's go Mountain Lions! I have two papers due next Tuesday. 
My individual project is a research topic. I have another Monday. physics exam on Friday. I need to start talking about the final grade of the As college students, stress can overwhelm us in a short matter of time and leave us feeling hopeless, frustrated, and helpless. Stress is a part of everyone's life, but if not dealt with properly, it can lead to several health problems. Signs of chronic stress can cause dizziness, aches and pains, problems sleeping, racing heartbeat, headaches, exhaustion, and weight gain. Finding a way to cope with stress can help with these side effects as well as promoting general well-being. Some tips for reducing stress include relaxation techniques such as meditation and yoga, regular exercise, learning to say no to requests that create excessive stress, getting eight hours of sleep at night, reducing alcohol and tobacco consumption, and just simply keeping a positive attitude and letting things roll off your shoulders. Reducing stress is a vital part of maintaining a healthy lifestyle and surviving college life. This has been a public service announcement from WVCU. My mom always said life was like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. The same can be said about WVCU Radio. With several student DJs covering varying genres of music, as well as an assortment of talk shows, you may just get a pop show filled with raspberry cream or an hour of caramel-covered political commentary. So continue tuning in to Channel 16 or at wvcu.concord.edu, because WVCU just might take me anywhere. Attention football fans! Be sure to tune in to WVCU Radio on Saturday, November 16th as the Concord University Mount Lions take on the Shepherd University Rams at Concord's own Callahan Stadium. WVCU DJs will be announcing live from the football game, so be sure to tune in to Campus Channel 16 or online at wvcu.concord.edu to show your support for the Lions. Kickoff is at 1 p.m. Don't miss it. Hey Arnold, what's up? Who are you? I'm one of WVCU's DJs. I'm Dalton. Talk to the hand. Come on, Arnold, don't be like that. I'm just trying to help you out with some- Stop it! You're being a jerk, Arnold. You started it. Why are you so moody? Look, I'm just trying to let you know that you can listen to WVCU online. Just visit wvcu.concord.edu. Thanks for the tip. Don't mention it. Thanks for listening in. No problemo. And hey, remember, it's wvcu.concord.edu. Got it? Feel how soft my skin is. Okay, this is getting weird. If you're hearing this, you're probably listening to WVCU Radio. Well, what do you think? Leave us a comment on WVCU Radio's Facebook page. There you can see a list of show times, who's on air right now, our latest giveaways, and a slew of other goodies. You can even request songs to be played on your favorite shows. So join in and actually be a part of your radio station. Just follow us on Facebook and be sure to listen in on Campus Channel 16 and at wvcu.concord.edu. Club music and screeching tires filled the air last Thursday when motorcycle group Stunt Army visited Concord University. Students gathered along the far end of the football field parking lot and watched as the performers did wheelies, burned out, and did other death-defying tricks. Cassie Molchanoff was just one of the many students that enjoyed the show and was awed by the professional cyclists. Some of the stuff they did just doesn't seem like it would be real at all. You just see it on the TV a lot, but to see it in person is a completely different spectrum. And it was just an awesome show. If you ever see these guys anywhere else, I'd recommend going, for sure. The driving force behind getting performances such as these to Concord's campus is the director of student affairs, Andrew Sulgent, who had some reasons of his own for booking Stunt Army. I'm a motorcycle rider myself, so I just kind of wanted to get somebody um, on campus that could put on a good show, and I knew these guys could do it. So. However, while it seems like all fun and games, there are a lot of risks in this form of entertainment. The lead cyclist of Stunt Army, Charlie Ross, has seen his fair share of injuries. I broke a couple bones, um, a lot of road rash, but if you treat it with respect and take your time, you usually learn, you know, don't, it's not too bad. With anything, it comes with the territory. If you didn't, you know, have that opportunity to get hurt, then it wouldn't be fun because there would be no fear involved. There wasn't a large turnout, but the general reaction from students was positive and the motorcyclists and Stunt Army seemed to have had fun. You can tell by the tire marks that remain days after. From Concord University parking lot in Athens, West Virginia, I'm Dalton Paul, WMLT News.